Well, good morning, good morning, my good friends. I'm back here in the kitchen, and it's still very early. I've turned all the lights on so I can actually see. And I'm back with my uh, adolescents. These are the, um, there was approximately 100. Uh, they were cocoons and little babies. And there were uh, just a couple that looked like they were reaching maturity, I would say, you know, that almost three inch if you stretch it, stretched it out. But um, anyway, we were here eight days ago, and I think that was our first real look inside. Uh, it was the 27th, and I had let it go for almost two weeks. So it's been a, it's been a good week, and I just wanted to uh, check back and see the last time if you look at that one, you'll see that we had added some strawberry tops and gave it a little bit of uh, cornmeal and eggshells. And, but, uh, but this was, uh, these were, I won't say they were volunteers, but they came from my a planter that I have out on the back porch. And I always call it my Meals on Wheels because it was, uh, it's, it's a long planter. And the um, worms actually I was taking castings and putting it in my miracle Grow potting soil in that Meals on Wheels planter. And I noticed that I had a few, um, they probably went from cocoons to wisp to uh, worms. And um, so I decided to try and start this as like a little auxiliary bin just to see if I could. And uh, so... It's got holes in the top, and it's got holes on the sides, both sides. And so, let's just peel back and see what we've got. The last time, the first real feeding that I gave it was on this side. And so, I'm just going to peel these back. And I don't see anybody on there. Nope, I don't see anybody on that one. I don't see anybody there either but I do see some eggshells left it just might be a little bit too dry for them to be taken down but I don't really see any tomato tops do you see tomato tops Gosh. Uh, uh, sorry strawberry tops that was what we put in here I see somebody poking up and poking down and I see some oh there there's one strawberry top dig down a little further this is this is like mining Mining for gold here. I think the last time we saw worms. And I'm hoping there. Whoops. Boy, he's a. He's a wiggler. <laughs> and he's red. Wow. What should we call him? How about Mr. Red Wiggler? Yay. There he is. Ooh, fruit size boy, isn't he? Wow. He's a healthy little guy. And there's some there's a little one. And there's another little one. I'm assuming these are red wigglers. I somebody uh, commented they thought maybe it was uh, a pot worm. But I think pot worms are much more white. Oops, I see somebody else down below there. Maybe I'm not reaching in here far enough. I think it's the same guy again. He keeps coming up for the for the audition. 
there's some more. Wow, they're fast. He's a mover. Here's another one. And there's, I think that same strawberry top. Okay, so that's that side. Come on, guys, move back down. And uh, let's see if we've got anybody on the other side. I see some little ones. I, I spy. Did you play that as a kid? I spy. Something, something. And then somebody else had to guess what it was. Wasn't that the deal? I think I'm going to take this. Let me move these out. Let's see what we got on the other side. Oh, there's a strawberry top that flung over. And let's see what we've got under here. We haven't moved this side yet. And I'm trying to do this gently with a a little little spoon that so nobody gets hurt. Well, I'm not seeing a hundred, but I do see some nice healthy worms. Yep, there's more. Oh, they look like a nice size. They look like they're, they've put on size since I was here just eight days ago. I got the new shredder. Rick gave me a, a shredder for Christmas. Boy, aren't these romantic gifts. A new shredder and um, garden gloves. Mmm, what a guy. He could write a book. There we go. There's another one. And I haven't seen, I, I think they all look like red wigglers, but I could be wrong. What would that one be? Is that a red wiggler? Yes, that looks like a red wiggler. Poor guy, he's trying to find the end. All right, we'll go back there. And I think we've, I think we've tossed them up enough and upset their day. I wouldn't call that a worm ball, but I would say it's some some little selves and yellow tails. Hmm. There you are, sweeties. Poor little souls. It's it's cool here, by the by. Uh, it was fifty. Well, yesterday morning it was forty-eight. And, um, and it only went up to, I think, 64 yesterday. And so I'm just kind of smoothing this all back out. I'm still not using my hand, sorry. Come on. Okay. So now this time, let's do it on the, on the left-hand side here. Oh, sorry. Here, scoot your little self over there. We'll make a little divot. Uh, this morning, it was uh, 57. I think probably dropped to about 55. And I'm in Windermere, Florida. We're zone 9B. But we have this nice cool front coming through. Okay, so we did that. Uh, so now my uh, bedding is, uh, is a little different because it's this shredder that is um, uh, a 12 sheet shredder. I had a six sheet shredder before. So we'll give it a little of that and give it a little bit of um, 
banana peel that I had from yesterday actually so it's not fresh fresh but I didn't freeze it and and of course strawberry tops we have to lay in there ever so nicely because we just love our artistry put their little faces down little extra pieces and this is an Everglades tomato and I just absolutely have to see if it will germinate in here Let's see if they what they do with it okay so to add to that we're going to add a little bit of cornmeal you know I'm trying to add accordingly um, I doubt there's more than oh what, what would you guys think maybe two ounces of worms maybe a little more than that I don't know three ounces so I'm trying to only add that much food and of course eggshell because we all know that they they need their grit because they don't have teeth they do have a uh like a, i think it's an upper like a lip that actually like you know where i want to say it's a muscle and it, it just grabs onto things and kind of pulls it in and so now we're going to then scoot this all back over and cover it all up there I feel like I'm I'm hiding the prize you know this is kind of like a um, um, a treasure hunt and they get to find it I'm going to back this off and we're going to put this back on And today is the fifth and so maybe by the the middle of the month we'll come back whoops put the lid back on we don't want anybody jumping out and escaping and so that will be it for uh, today's feeding I hope you guys enjoyed this and if you did I hope you'll subscribe and ring the bell so that you know where I am and when and what I'm doing and this is just a little uh, shoe box and uh, just again it's not to, meant to uh, to house a thousand worms or anything like that if these guys all make it then I will go ahead and take them and add them uh, to another uh, bin that they can then go on and produce and and make more babies and then um, maybe we'll get something else started in here so take care everybody garden what you've got and I hope to see you back real soon bye bye